So we're going to talk a little bit about uh, uh, some issues we had at this fire and some of the initial uh, problems we had were uh, we kept getting conflicting addresses where the actual location of the fire was. Um, so from from the uh, first arriving companies, companies, I think it's important to whichever building's on fire, make sure one, you give out the address or if it's a well-known uh, business, maybe uh, announce that on the radio. Uh, all that's going to come into play for, for the second and, and next arriving companies going to the rear. They're not really going to know have a good place to start or uh, initial starting point. So uh, call out the, the uh, address and if you're coming in uh, second due or you think you're going to the rear, if you have a chance and you're driving by, Try to count the number of businesses uh, from the end you'll be arriving at at the rear. Uh, you, you may get to the rear and you don't have those address numbers uh, painted on the, the rear door. So if you have the opportunity on your way by, try to count the number of businesses. Uh, that way you get in the rear, you have a good, good uh, place to start. Uh, maybe you can uh, throw a ladder uh, and, and get a vantage point from the rear that way. Um, but that was that was one of the things we learned on this fire was the the address was different uh, than the one on the run card so the guys in the rear had a tough time knowing where to start forcing entry in the rear uh, it, re remember when we're starting off of those doors uh, we're making emergency exits for us so that's that needs to be done ASAP